Greetings everyone, Game Master Cody here again. This is part 7 of our English Naval Challenge. We still only have 4 units, but that's about to change because Japan is coming to declare war on us. And I can see that coming a mile away. So I have my boats ready. And I know that the general won't really help our naval units have better fighting power, but I can't really do anything about that. I cut three turns off the cargo ship. Well, the choke point did not work. There. And you wait back here. I know it's about to happen, so I could take the preemptive strike, but let's just play smart for now. Come on, Japan. Oh, that's bad. Is Suleiman about to declare war on me too? Because this could actually bode poorly. Although if I can get some... Okay, good. My science went up a lot. Actually, let's see if I can do this. Oh. Yeah, he covets lands I own. No. Well, he has less gold than I do. What about Suleiman? I know oh, he's pretty backstabby as it is, so he has a thousand gold. No way to make it work. Oh. And no way to make it work. So this could get nasty quite quickly. <sighs> Not a lot I can do about it. Just this isn't the ideal style, but I needed to challenge myself because I. But I just don't have the gold or the science to do anything about it right now. So they're about to declare war on me. As he sits there, haha. <laughs> yeah, he's just waiting to do nothing, right? No, that's not going to happen. And here comes Japan. He's plotting something. If he goes to war against Suleiman, that'll be funny, but I doubt it. I'm pretty sure he's going for me. Just wait. Just wait. Just need this island over here. Am I building this as fast as I can? No. I guess it really doesn't ma matter too much. Let's get gold while we're waiting. Because we kind of need some. 
I would like to get the chocolate down here, but I have to expand there, and that'll probably be a while. But I could chop the jungle. Um. Still waiting for Japan to declare war. Maybe Suleiman's going to declare war on him. That's weird. Nah, he's probably going for York, because I have uh, King Solomon's mines. Hope we have a great scientist. I need to get my worker out of here because this stupid uh, spearman's going to try something dumb. Wow, really? I will declare war before I let him have this city. Wellington. Let's actually go to Bursa. We need money. Oh, we need science. You get your stupid settler out of here. This is my town. I don't care. I will. I will declare war. He's not getting my city. On Japan, get out. All right, let's get the city to grow now that it's made plenty of good buildings. Science. Hmm. All right, that'll be a little bit faster. Good. The uh, what are we doing now? Oh, they could make a hill there. Let's get a farm. We need more growth. I'm just waiting because once that settler hits the water, I'm uh, I'm taking him out if he if he tries to go for my city over here. Of course, with Japan's having their boats all over here, they're going to take out my trade routes, which suck. Japan, get out of here! Positive gold again. But how long would that last? These are these need to be farms. I 
Okay, so barbarians plundered a trade route. Which means I need to go deal with barbarians. Okay, good. I've got compass. You're not settling here. I'm going to make sure that you don't. Alright. Now we gotta fix this back up again. We've got to grow, but we also got to need. We also need science very badly. Three, four. Uh, let's see, nineteen or twenty-four. We got to keep our gold at a minimum. Or, at least we're not losing it. Since I bought the silk, he can't settle here because he can't settle directly next to a tile that someone else owns, which means he can't settle anywhere over here. Fortunately, I get four movement in water, and he does not. If I can get him just to dance back and forth to keep him from going over here. If that's what I have to do, I'll do it. So it means there's barbarians through here. Yeah, through that camp right there, so... I'll need to be careful because I may lose a trade route myself. But I gotta keep Japan from getting this city location. Two, three, four, one, two, three. In four turns, I should be able to have that city. I just gotta keep Japan away. That's right. Go back and forth. You're not going here. Oh, and Suleiman does the exact same thing. You jerk. Get out of here. Yeah, let's just keep it there for now. If I have to, I have to go around the long way, I'll do that. Just good, so Limon's moving. Try right back to the water you go. Don't come back. Careful. 
So I don't want to lose my settler. Oh wait, you go back and... You stay there. You move here. He's not getting through. That's fine, they can have it. Okay, let's be very, very careful. Could I go there and make a city? I could form a second city over here, actually. Yeah, we get all this stuff. We get that atoll, the horses, the fish. So right here, I just want to get the ivory and the iron. That one's out of the question anyway, so... Just gonna have to keep Japan at bay. Actually, yes, we need some galleasses as well. And a cargo ship. We have a lot of things we have to do now. Ah, well, someone's getting there. Someone's getting upset. Mathematic. <laughs> Alright, we'll get currency in a second so we can get markets, mint, and Petra's been built, so whatever. Let's go back and build a hill. Okay, good. We are good to go. We've reached our location. I'm still keeping him from settling because I don't want him settling over here. Yeah, I think this would be the best location. I lose the. I do lose the. The river, but I gain iron, two ivory horses, bison, this hill, and I could probably get a second city over here eventually. Or I could let Japan do it and just burn it to the ground. But that's no fun. Actually, this is gone. Turn's gone on long enough. Skin Master Cody signing out. I'll see y'all next time.